Hello friends and welcome to another video. Got another question concerning identify. This was very interesting. Could you please do a video on how to fill in the metadata on identify? Now, with content ID, but in this case, we're talking about identify. It's very simple, okay? And I'll probably leave a screenshot here, but I, I've covered this before. Uh, they give you some extra metadata that you can fill in, but it's certainly not necessarily to, to go that far. Uh, but I, I think that just by adding your name and the title of the track is enough. This is what I've been doing and it has already given me some results. So you don't need to really uh, go about uh, filling up the whole thing uh, because at the end of the day, I'm working only with music tracks that are uh, aimed for licensing, but there's certainly different titles. Uh, there's certainly different information that you can fill in on, on identify. I don't know how other content ID services work, uh, but as far as I know, and this is what Identify has mentioned to me when I reach out to them, is that as long as you have the title and the actual file, right, the music track, uh, that should be enough to, to find your music online because at the end of the day, it's a fingerprint that it goes into the WAV file, uh, into the actual audio, right? So, uh, I mean, there's a track, for example, that I title, uh, I had trouble titling, I can't remember what, what what track it was, but it was an acoustic track, I remember clearly. And for some crazy reason, I couldn't give it the original title and identify. And I contact support and I said like, listen, I have, I'm trying to upload this track, it has been uploaded, but I, I wanna edit the metadata, the title, because the title is not that one, it's this one. So I'm concerned that if that's gonna be a problem in order to, for you guys to find that track, and, and uh, they said no. Okay, so meaning that the title that I have given to that track is not the original title of the file. Okay, and I, and I believe I did something like it's the title and then in brackets something else, like acoustic guitar. And uh, that track has been picked up by the system. So meaning that it works. They mentioned like, okay, yeah, just give it the name. Thank you, thank you for let us, letting us know, uh, but it should be all right. So I don't think you have to stress too much about this. Just give it the title uh, of your track, your name, and, and off you go. Uh, I mean, it, by all means, uh, fill up the whole thing if you want to, but I don't think it's, it's needed for, for what we're doing here. And, you know, see how it goes for you. I really wish a lot of success to you if you're new to Content ID. I mean, it, it has been a, a game changer for me. I'm gonna be talking more about Content ID in future videos uh, because it's still early days for me. I've only been, using it for, for one quarter, meaning that Content ID has been uh, picking up, or Identify has been picking up my music uh, for only one quarter, and I'm, I'm getting paid now as I'm recording this at the end of the month in the next few weeks. So again, this is money that I did not make with my music up until this point when I just joined uh, Content ID, and I'm very excited. I have seen some crazy results with uh, Identify and Content ID in general. So I'm really looking forward to be one of those success stories and, and uh, share it here on the channel with you so you can get excited as well and hopefully you can get the same results. Uh, if you're new to this and you would like to get started, uh, and even if you have experience with, with music, but you would like to monetize your tracks, download my free guide link in the description where I'm sharing you the seven steps on how to get started. It's always been updated. Uh, this particular guide has been updated now for 2024 and I'm adding uh, certain things here to the guide on a regular basis, like for example, Content ID, which is something that is not part of the guide, but because I've just joined Content ID and I've seen some results, and uh, I update the guide with this type of, of things. And not only libraries that I'm joining, new libraries that I find all the time online, uh, but as well, uh, different strategies that have helped me, um, you know, not only make a full-time income with my music, but help others as well do the same thing. Anyways, drop a comment below if you have any questions. I'm going through some comments and trying to answer in the form of a video. Uh, I mentioned before that it's a little bit hard for me to go uh, into the comments, not because it's a lot of, of comments that you guys leave on the videos, uh, but because it's too many videos. And, it, and it's hard for me to keep up with, with like you know going through every single video, like okay, even if it's three or four comments underneath the videos in question, it, it's hard for me to keep up because I'm not releasing one video a week anymore. So at times I get the, the comment or the question gets lost and I have to go back uh, from time to time and see what questions you guys have made. 
And if it hasn't been answered, then I, I would like to make a short video here and, and answer your questions uh, with a screenshot so, so all the other composers and musicians that have the same questions uh, can, can see the answer, okay? Because once you guys type in a question in the comment, if I answer it there, not everybody's going underneath and reading the question or the answer for that matter. So I would like to, to provide you uh, with an answer in the form of a short video and hopefully that's helpful to you. My, my point is that I want to uh, provide you with as much value as possible uh, here on the channel. Uh, loads of things are in the pipeline for me in terms of uh, music, composition, and of course income. My passion is the music, but as well the business side of it. How can we make money with our music? And that's something that I'm really passionate about. Uh, and the yeah, Content ID is, is the latest uh, addition to to how I diversify um, in terms of, of income, in terms of uh, cash flow, with the same music that I have composed years ago, by the way. Obviously, when I compose a new track now, I upload it to Identify, and, I'd, and, and that's part of my, my MO, if you will. Uh, but there's a lot of things that I wanna share here with you, and uh, they're coming very, very soon uh, here on the channel. And uh, if you've been following me, you know that I've been uh, showing up here lately, uh, every single day, like I mentioned. I've been doing a lot of videos lately and I really enjoy it because it's part of my, my daily practice, okay? It's a part of a daily uh, habit, if you will, and I get to work and, you know, I fire up Logic, and, well, my computer and, and whatever I'm working, I might be working on different things at the time and, and I just, you know, create videos here for you. And um, I'm gonna be very active here on the channel. This is only the beginning, my friend, okay? I've been doing these YouTube videos for, for some time now, but I feel like now I'm getting into a different uh, modality or a different rhythm of creating content here for you guys. And I really wanna document my journey. I have a, a body of work here on the channel in terms of videos of everything that I've done over the years. Um, but I, I am projecting myself into the future to see how, how much better can I make the information that I'm sharing here with you and how can I share my journey as well as I am doing music and earning money with my music. Anyways, thank you so much for all the love and support and I'll see you in another video, my friend.